What's up guys, my name is Section from the Deviants, and today we're going to be reacting to My Hero Academia Season 4, Episode 9. So as of right now, they are in pursuit of Aerie. They are in the Hakaisai hideout, trying to, I, I mean, they're technically not trying to capture Overhaul, but I mean, capturing Overhaul would be nice. The main thing is capturing, not capturing, the main thing is saving Aerie, who the villains are using her blood to take away powers or take away quirks for a limited amount of time the last episode it was a sun eater episode where he was facing off against three of the bad people and they were going through you know his past and you know how he feels about him and mirio and why he got his name and you know just the whole character building backstory that we usually get again i relate what's going on to kind of like what happens in naruto and they're trying to save sasuke from the sound ninjas where each character who's on this like savioral retrieval mission gets their time to shine where they kind of like get into their backstories and and why they do what they do so i'm guessing this episode is also going to be involved in that it says red riot so i'm guessing we're gonna get kirishima's kind of backstory hopefully we'll get more on what they teased back when he faced off against the knife dude in the alleyway. So without further ado, let's get straight on into it. Make sure to support the original content as always. All right, let's get going in three, two, one, and bam. The neurotoxin should be circulating throughout your bodies at this point. Under how far ahead the others are now. I need to catch up. Boom, dead. I guess I was hurt worse than I thought. You're gonna be fine, I hope. My worry is that the villains are gonna wake up a lot quicker than you are, and then they just eat their way out of the little squid, and then you're just unconscious with three bad guys who could just kill you. Oh man, I'm a cheeky. I'm really worried about him. You've left a comrade to guard your back, and if you're a real man, you'll trust him. Yeah, he'll handle it, no problem. It doesn't take much to change your mind, does it? Strange. The guy who was manipulating the building seems to have eased off for some reason. It's possible he decided to focus all his attention on them instead. So there's a limit to how much of the building he can keep tabs on? It's just a theory. A game theory. I can't believe you all came out to try and stop us. It seems crazy to me. Well, it's not. Overhaul would have killed us without a thought. Overhaul? That's true. As much as you dislike Chisaki, you seem pretty sure that we're not going to catch him. He don't stand a chance. Got nothing to lose. Oh, we're taking racer. him out first. We'll just have to take care of these guys myself. No. Be careful, Bat. I feel like he could. I feel like he could handle him. Where'd oh. you come from? Oh gosh, darkness? Not nah, it. Go ahead, punch me. No, my arms are. You know what I think? What the Knives heck? Knives and guns got no place in a fight. I don't know, you guys. You you got something on your hand. I I call that an enhancement. Oh, he got what? a bubble shield? What the it's heck? Like some kind of barrier. So we have oh, someone else, of course. A boy with a hardening quirk. I can feel his blows. Dang, already? Fat. Each punch is like a bullet. We are a spear and a shield, whereas you are simply two shields. To be fair, I don't know whether that boy even qualifies as one. If you let them break your spirit, that means you've lost. When you're up against villains, the key is making them lose their will to fight first. Yeah, that's what he said in the big in the beginning. I like the way that fat guy thinks. All right, this is starting to get good. All I want is a good death match. Very well. If you think you can take them yourself, by all means. That's more like it. What is wrong with me? I was so sure I'd gotten stronger. You did. You're just not strong enough. Come on, wide load, hang in there. You can't pass out on me yet. We got a long I totally did not realize that Fat Gum had hair. Useless bastard! Your heart need cracks and there's nothing worthwhile underneath! Can't I do anything? Uh-oh, now he's gonna have an existential crisis. It's just like it was back then. Yep, Nothing's here we go. Changed. There's the past. You're the guy who can change leaves into money, right? So make these into some bills quick, dude. 
We're kind of short on cash. Seriously? What's up? You bullying a kid for some chump change? That's not very manly, jerks. Here he comes. I got him. <laughs> He's not actually that strong. Forget about it, Kirishima. <laughs> you were watching? Why are you always sticking your neck out like that, man? Oh. She's really laying into him. And now they're getting along? Hold on, are they breakdancing? Wait, what the, what the heck? What in the world just happened? I hear that Ashido is applying to UA. <laughs> it's all about entertainment value and approval ratings these days. But if you have a chivalrous heart, it doesn't matter what your quirk is. Train your body as hard as you can, and your spirit will make up for your Ooh, that's, that's brain damage right there. Hey, speaking of high school, I'm kind of thinking I might go for UA too. Please, normal people like us don't grow up to be heroes, idiot. Seeing somebody like Ashido in action got me thinking. What if I had a flashier quirk? We are looking at another sunny day tomorrow, and it'll be real What important. is that? Well, dang. Tell me where it is. We got Hercules? No. I could do it. Oh, no, you're not. Oh, you're gonna get hit. Come on! <laughs> oh, she's gonna save the day. Oh, nice. I froze. That was smart. Why didn't I go? You didn't have confidence. It's okay. Everyone has confidence issues. Some just hide them better than others. In the spring, a guy the same age as me was in the news for fighting back against a villain. Another kid? His friend, maybe. No, my friend. When you're really scared, when your life is really on the line, that's when your true colors show. I'm not a hero. I'm not even a man. Now you have to clean that up. That's not it, is it? <laughs> no, I'm sorry. Oh, it came with a book on great heroes I got for my birthday a while ago. Even among heroes, you have a reputation for being a bit reckless. Are you ever afraid in those situations? What kind of question is that? Of course I'm afraid. But there's something I fear more. The look on someone's face as they die, that's far worse. It's the fear of seeing that look again that drives me. All right, Kirishima, you gotta watch someone die. You want to know what chivalry means to me? Living a life with no regrets. You serious, E? Yeah. <gasps> what is up with that hair? Get a new look for high school? You've got horns like me. Yeah? I'm not the pathetic loser I used to be. <laughs> the face. Once you get over yourself, let me know, okay? I'm being nice and holding back for now. But someday I'm gonna tell everyone about your little makeover. Adorable. I've been in a ton of scary situations since then. All right, while you while you were reminiscing, <sighs> yeah. That guy was getting destroyed. I've been absorbing every blow you dealt me, sinking each one into my body and storing its power. Doing that takes energy and burns the fat that protects me from taking serious damage. Tell me what you got! Don't hold anything back! Red! I won't regret anything! Now or ever again! I'll e do it! I'll All right, kid! Let's go! Ah! The two of you are gonna lose. Do you wanna know why? We underestimated the hero named Red Riot. And his chivalrous spirit! Dang, I like Beckham. The victory is ours. What a cool quirk. So at first I thought Beckham's uh, quirk was just absorbing the punches or absorbing things. But in actuality, he... He's able to store whatever energy that's getting attacked to him. And as he's storing it, it's using energy. And that's why he, that's why he's able to use all that fat. He's able to release that energy through whatever means. Right back at a person. So his ability almost reminds me of like gravity and or like a ricochet effect where whatever gets whatever energy gets dealt, it'll come back with even more energy. And yeah, it was it was cool seeing Red Riot's um, past and um, 
seeing his relationship with the girl meaning that like they were in the same sort of middle school together even if they weren't in the same class they were still in the same middle school and they were still admitted to ua at the same time so they had that sort of connection that many other people may not have that gets me wondering like what other people were in like the same school together because we all we already know um of course bakugo and uh deku we now know kirishima and the girl and we know sun eater and lamillion so i wonder if anybody else ended up in the same like school system before they reached ua like what who has what passed anyways that was my reaction to my hero academia season 4 episode 9 if you like my reaction make sure to like and subscribe if you guys want me to know anything more put a comment section down below and i'll see you guys next time bye